Hi, it's is Ron McTuber playing the Hunter Classic on PC and today a mega update has come out and we didn't know about this, it was coming out today. The brand new turkey models are out. They've updated the turkeys and we're going hunting for them now on White Up. I've got the 223 semi-automatic rifle which is brilliant for long range shots but sometimes when the turkeys run you can shoot them as well so it's really useful to have that and I've got a snake bite bow. I've also got my turkey box collar to lure them in. I can't wait to see these new models and like I say a lot of us have seen on the forums and we've seen the steam update come through 3 gigabyte, and we just thought it was the new shotgun um, and the new blinds but then someone posted on discord that there was a new turkey model and it was out. We all knew about the new turkey model we just didn't know it was out today so it's a great surprise. The notes for the build and the update haven't gone out yet as of making this video so we didn't know exactly it was included with the new uh, content that's been added so it's a really good surprise and I can't wait to see them. Now in this update we know that the turkeys are going to probably have redone animations so it's going to be nice looking to see how fluid these are now because the old turkey model which a lot of us have been waiting to be updated and um, some of the movements were a little janky a little not robotic but they weren't as fluid as they possibly could be so I'm looking forward to see how they are now also what the models actually look like like the feathers and the claws the head the colouring we've seen a few pictures um, on social media but we haven't seen them in action and that's what we're going to hopefully do now we have got some turkeys in front of me so I'm just going to keep giving it a little bleat on the caller little squawk my turkey box caller and hopefully lure our first male in what we're going to do is try and get a nice decent male and then we'll have a close-up look at it when we get it in the trophy shot mode so we'll be able to see it really close with that but i'm hoping to see animations as soon as we spot one this is a really good place it's near the middle lake left hand side all the surrounding meadows uh, are really good for turkey so head around the middle lake and have a look around but like I say, if you want exact locations where I've got my tents and stuff for Turkey, check out my previous Turkey videos. I've done one recently, a Turkey guide, and it really does help how to get turkeys. They're not too hard. Um, it's just a bit of time, patience, and then like waiting for your quarry to come in. Just right now. I know he's here somewhere. He's just trying to spot them. It will call again soon, as long as you don't spook them. You can just stay crouched and just keep calling them and they will just keep coming and once you get a few of them coming they will just keep coming and coming and coming right here is our first male I don't know how big he is but I can already see straight away by the movements of the turkey how much smoother it is normally the turkey on the old model its neck will crane round and it will sort of like go awkwardly to the side this looks more fluid when it's walking I can already tell by the tail is much more fluid in movement so already and we can't see it properly yet I can tell straight away just by the little movements it's just rocking its head slightly side to side put a great amount of detail into it and we haven't even seen it properly yet but I can already tell that by the movements as it walks as it comes from behind this bush we'll get a closer look I can just see the little giblet <laughs> as we call it or whatever hanging off its head look a little bit more sleek as well I do like that we used to keep turkeys um, many years ago so I do know what they look like up close but you can definitely tell by the movements they are a lot cleaner a lot slicker a lot better the feathers look uh, a lot smarter as well. Before you sort of have like jagged things on the tail feathers, and a lot of people used to say about this. Uh, and like I say, it's probably been it's been close to ten years since turkeys have been added, so it's a it's a warranted update. See, look how smooth that is now on the fan on the tail. And turkeys are really hard to animate. That's one of the reasons why they haven't been done as well. Uh, because of the movements and the complexity of the birds and the feathers but as you can see look how he waddles 
that is really nice and really smooth they look a lot better as well so this has given uh, the game a big update and we like I say we didn't know this was today either we just thought it was uh, the shotguns and the blinds which are great but not like the turkeys turkeys are very popular amongst the hunter classic community and they're one of the favorite species of a lot of people and a lot of the American people especially uh, really like turkey hunting um, it's one of the most wanted animals in um, the hunter call of the world but like I say the hunter classic fans are gonna be jumping up and down as soon as they see this because they are really good I just got in the bush I might try and take him let's just see what the distance is with the bow ideally I would take him with the bow out of a tree stand because when you're in the tree stand you've got aerial position but these called as soon as I spawned in um, so I thought I'd shoot that oh there's one on my right as well I was just going to shoot that but let's look at this one I think that's bigger what's this one 50 to 70 we're going to take this one whatever before it runs right we'll take that with a 223 semi-automatic and this is why you carry this gun because if they don't fly and they run you can nail them and get a bonus bird um, so that's two we've got two for the price of one let's go and have a look at this one on the right first because that was the bigger male and we didn't see that one uh, often is the case when you're calling in turkey groups will come in I've had up to 25 birds come in and you just nail them one after another with a bow that's one of the reasons you carry a bow but we got snuck up on there <laughs> and we nailed it with a 223 I knew if I shot that one with a bow probably wouldn't have got that one so we nailed it and it's quite a big bird actually it's nearly 61 so what we're going to do now is we're going to spin it round and hopefully <laughs> the ragdoll physics in this can be really hard to get a good position with uh, turkeys especially and often I'll edit this off camera and uh, try and get a position just so you can see it but we're gonna have a look at his spurs its feathers the neck the beard and just see what's new but as you can already see look how detailed these claws are the spurs on the turkey really good I'm loving the coloring as well the, uh, the coloring is a lot more vivid the feathers are a lot more nicer and cleaner the detail like I say looks a lot more sharp as well but look at those feet really detailed a lot better this is what we wanted for many years like I say it's been probably 10 years since Turkey come out so this is a really big update for the game and like I say we haven't had anything like this for the Hunter Classic for quite a few years so it is a big deal to a lot of the players but the feathers are really nice like I say uh, a lot cleaner the colors are very nice vibrant it's sort of like a orangey bronze on some of the feathers and on the chest of the turkey on the males I'll spin it around and try and get a better look this is very awkward to try and get him right especially on the neck when you want to try and get it straight it'd be nice if you could lock off the neck and um, when you're doing trophy shots or to have a close look at them same as some of the wings or limbs but that might actually make it hard as well but to get certain parts of the body it would be nice to lock them off so if you're watching devs that'd be a great tip but there you can see look at that right up close look how detailed they are now they are really detailed and very well done so whoever's done this big thumbs up from Ron the community will love this update because they look really good really impressed with the bird already how they move how they look is a lot better than they were previously and that's what we wanted to know are they better than they were and um, is the update worth it and it's definitely yes it's a big yes I'm very happy about it so thank you very much to the team right let's try and get his neck in the right position and this is one of the hardest things to do with turkey and try and get in the positioning right but as you can see orange red bronze and bright blue on the head which is a bit more prominent now than it used to be look how the feathers are layered on the back and on the wings they're more cleaner more rounder so they've definitely put a lot of effort in and a lot of people might not just realize how much effort goes into making these models and these animations as good as they can they do take time it's not a short short term thing they put a lot of hours in to get this right uh, can Ron get the neck straight? <laughs> I think we might be uh, swapping to a little edit in a minute just to show you this. Oh, that's quite a good position. There you go to show you the feathers and the neck and the head and the colouring. 
but look you can see that's a lot cleaner all round a lot sharper the detail is a lot better the feet the wings the tail feathers the head the neck the colors everything is more vibrant and better you know what that's a good position isn't it that's a good position for a trophy shot I think no <laughs> Sometimes when you're moving them about, you forget where your fingers and your brain has a little bloop, and then you drop it and you're like, no, I had that in perfect position, but that is a good position to show you the neck. There you go. So a lot of blue, merges into sort of a purple red, and then carries on with bronze down the chest. So here's the edit, because Ron couldn't get it exactly how I wanted it to show you. So I can show you the front of the turkey, the male turkey, so orangey bronze on the front of the chest goes to grey black on the feathers and then up to the neck which is sort of red you can see the feet and the tail feathers but the colours are a lot more prominent now which is good like I say well done to the team you've nailed this I wonder if any other animals will get a working over um, what would you like to see happen to any other animals tweaked drop that in the comments i would like to hear about that so after lots of swearing i've got in this position which took <laughs> about 10 minutes to get just right and that's going to be my trophy shot i think that might actually be the thumbnail for the video so let's go and collect our other bird what do you think to the turkeys do you like them are you going to go out hunting them i can see a lot of people are going to be hunting them all weekend uh, um, what do you think to them give them marks out of 10 is there anything you'd like to see changed? What do you think is the best thing about the new turkeys? Drop that in the comments, I want to hear about it. Also, yesterday I started my Hunting Friends series back up. So anyone that wants to play multiplayer, if you use Discord and you've got a microphone, you can take part. Basically, you hunt with me, we have some fun, and I record it and we make an episode for it. Check out the other episodes if you're not sure what I'm talking about. I've made... I've got quite a few more already made hunting with various people and you'll get the gist of what it is but everyone can take part so i've been looking at the brand new turkeys the turkey models the turkey animations what do you think about it drop it in the comments i think the team have absolutely smashed it 10 years in the waiting and they've nailed it you've updated the turkeys they're like new and a lot of people are going to enjoy them this will boost life into the hunting classic which is always a great thing I've enjoyed hunting the turkeys. How about you? Are you off out to hunt them? I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channels and thanks for watching. Bye bye.